Okay, looks good now. We're all recording. So welcome, everybody. We're gonna play some more Tag Force for the day. We're gonna have ourselves a wholesome little time. Let's just go here first. So we're just gonna unwind for the rest of the stream with a little bit of Yu-Gi-Oh. I did finally start doing some False Bound Kingdom. I got like seven hours of uh, that recorded and uploaded. And I'm gonna do some more of that, but I wanna do another session of Tag Force here. It has been an exceptionally busy week for me, surprisingly. Let me see here. There's doing the Slifer Boys right away. Ah, why not? We gotta get warmed up. Little sessions of Yu-Gi-Oh here. Horror of the Black Light. Total Destruction. Clown Brigade. Back of a front. Let's start with you. We gotta get warmed up by just setting everything on fire. That's the one that's still sh the, the deck that should still be set up as my main one. I was trying uh, trying to unlock more staples and stuff. Oh, pardon me. Hold that cough. Rio. He doesn't stand a chance. Anyway, so as I was just saying, yeah, stuff this week has been fun. For those that missed it, uh, my oven in my kitchen suddenly broke. And I had to go and buy myself a brand new one, because it couldn't be repaired. So that was fun. Sent you. And so yeah, I took yesterday off to go shopping for that. And now I g it's getting delivered like tomorrow. But the issue with that is that the time window they gave me means that I pretty much can't stream at all. Because it's right in the middle of the day and it's like a three hour window. So I'm a little bit annoyed. Anyways, let's activate these now. I was holding down the wrong button to try and prompt it earlier. That's okay. Let me activate it again. Perfect. Second one. Welcome, Vampy. Hi. So I'm gonna have to do a lot of streaming this weekend to make up for the days I suddenly had to take off to deal with that, but it's important. Gotta replace things. Mm, you're not attacking me. I think I'll start sending princesses down. Let's see what he does. Give him that turn one burn. Set him on fire. Give him the teddy boop. Once per turn during your main phase, flip this card to face down defense position. When this card is flipped, summon destroy him once your opponent's side of the field. Crap. Doesn't specify face up. That's actually a problem for me. Yep, thank you for the sub there, Vampy. I get the feeling when I, uh... Wait, what's this? When this monster destroys the following number of monsters as a result of battle, the following effects are activated in order. As long as this card remains face up on the field, negate the activation and effects of all spell and trap cards that target this card and destroy them. You can special summon one, uh... uh Fuchio Richie from your hand or deck by attributing this card during your main phase. What the heck is these? Interesting. Yeah, I have a feeling when I finish checking, uh, finish today's stream and check the goals, we're probably going to be very close to meeting the goal for Dark Souls. The Egglock is already happening. There we are. Mods just need a little bit more time to uh, polish it. Okay. I don't have to worry about this thing ruining my strategy anymore, so we can just set you. Perfect. They say it'll take about a week or so to be fully set up, so I just kind of decided to do some Emerald Rogue between that. Because I didn't get a chance to really do that last month, because I was doing, like, the Emerald brand uh, map randomizer. There we are. Excellent. Emerald Rogue is fun, but it's a little bit disheartening to go, like, three hours into a run. To, just to potentially lose it to, like, some really scummy tactics. Especially when the AI uses, like, uh, legendaries for some of that. Oh well. As long as it's entertaining, I'll upload a chat. I can't really be picky since, because of the stuff this week, I'm pretty low on things to upload. It's a good thing I did a crap ton of Falsebound Kingdom, but I haven't had a day to finish Pandora's Tower. I wanted to finish Pandora's Tower and start Oracle of Ages, but, uh... <laughs> I, I need, like, four or five hours set aside to do that last part of the game. Because there's, like, a save corruption glitch that, uh, will ruin it. Hang on. It's five stars, so we can send it back for that. Zombie mummy. Yeah, may as well do that. Force in the tribute. Okay, didn't do anything. Yeah, what I was just saying there, 
Pandora's Tower, the end of that game, the North American version, has a save corruption glitch that forces you to play, like, it all in one go to avoid it. So, that's what I have to do. Man, a lot of bad coincidences this week, huh? Should be okay, though. We're slowly burning this boy. There's nothing you can do about it. He's flipping that guy up. Don't need to use just desserts. He's bouncing that to my hand for some reason. Don't need to flip it yet. That's right. One more. Come on. Oh. He didn't attack, but now I can just flip this and win. Nice. We hit an issue with the sprites. They're apparently more messy than we thought, so we gotta rearrange the modded sprites more. That's perfectly fine. Like, we're not on a tight schedule. I appreciate you guys putting together that mod for the egg lock. We can, we can wait until whenever it's done. Oh man, you beat me. Darn, you're strong. Let's duel again. Okay, that worked out. Gonna farm some duel points. Cyrus is the only person whose hearts I've maxed out. Yes, talk to them a little bit. Hey, we were sleeping like a baby this morning. We got up early. We prepared for class. You shouldn't lie. Okay. A great talk. There's no reason to talk to Cyrus anymore. He's useless to me. Okay, duels. Had a great talk. Been a bit since I... I didn't duel Jaden as much in the re recent episodes. So let's duel him again. Get a clean 20 few ways to work around Pandora's Tower, it'll be okay. Yeah, I'm more so just salty about things like my whole schedule getting messed up this week. Like, you know me, if something goes wrong, I just, like, panic about it. I'm just like, oh no, it's a disaster now. Here we go, load the duel. So yeah, that's pretty much the reason I'm doing a long stream today. Because I can't stream tomorrow because I have to wait for the delivery people to show up in the middle of the day. Okay, do that. And... Hmm, is he gonna put face downs? I'm not so sure about that. I'll do that at the end, so I may as well just mill his deck. Heck, Cyrus, yeah. Alright, let's flip this up before I forget. Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh! has been a lot of fun lately. I've enjoyed it. That's the reason I started, um... Uh... I started Falsebound Kingdom, though, is because that game is not, like, the regular card gameplay. So doing that alongside Tag Force will feel a lot less re repetitive. Man, I just made him burn his spells that he would have played for Curse of Darkness. What a shame. Alright, I'll just throw down Princess first. I want to see if I can get a Skull Invitation. There we are. There's a channel on the Discord where people can submit their list of Pokémon. For the egg lock. There we are. You can't give it any ability. It has to be it has to be legal for the what's in Pokemon Platinum. And Platinum didn't even have hidden abilities anyway. Alright, here we go. You can just look at the Pokemon Cerebi page. It's the easiest way to get a feel for it. Hmm. I don't want to activate this because then it's just gonna burn me for more damage first. So, huh. I guess I probably should play Lightning Vortex, though, shouldn't I? Bit of a shame. That is gonna burn me a bit, but I need his monsters gone. I can't have him beating over me and attacking directly. So let's do this. I don't know when we're gonna close submissions, but oh, okay. Apparently we've already gotten a ton Everyone's allowed was allowed to submit uh, up to three eggs. Well, I guess I gotta do this now. Oh well, this is fine though. Heavy Storm buffed his back row as well. All right. That there, skyscraper. No curse of darkness to burn you this time, buddy. He flipped Clayman. He's going in with Clayman. He's going in with Clayman. I'm gonna mill him out before I burn him. 
Okay, no, no, he's doing this. Okay. Alright, perfect. Chain energy. Hmm. You know what, YOLO? Do it because it's funny, not because it's likely to win. Excellent. Oh, that's... Oh no, Jaden, stop. No, I don't want to anything but that. Don't make me draw five cards, you monster. <laughs> oh, okay. Clayman and probably Sparkman. Nice to see how Chain Energy interacts with that. I can just Dark Hold them next turn, too. This is great. You will give me an egg. Okay, he's gonna hit me for a bit of damage, though. Unfortunate, but I should be okay, I hope. 700. Yeah, what was I saying before I got distracted by Jaden uh, activating, like, a uh, cyber jar there? Or a morphing jar? Yeah, there, we've gotten so many egg submissions now that I'm afraid there's gonna be, a, inevitably gonna be a lot of people who just don't have their eggs used. But at least that means we won't know what any of them are gonna hatch into. Okay, let's do this. What? Okay. Guys, I just won. Okay. All I gotta do is set magic cylinder, and he attacks into it, and I win. Just in case, I should set Yomi ship as well. I should be okay, though. Okay, make sure he's he attacks with the giant, though, or wild heart. No, wait, magic, it won't affect, uh, won't affect, uh, him. So no, that's why I need Yomi ship. Smart boy. No. Come on, come on. Yes, just barely enough. Just barely enough. All according to plan. That was a pretty impressive finish. What do we got there? Did I get a level up bonus? No, I didn't. I just got a lot of, uh... A lot of ridiculous buffs there at the end. Not bad. I'll take it. Ah, so close. But a loss is a loss. Okay, let's do a Chumley now, too. We're at the point where we're grinding everybody to max affection and getting Chaz there. A bit repetitive, but y'all like to watch me play repetitive games for whatever reason. So let's just do it. Let's just do it. Ugh, I need a drink there. Okay, I'm good. Anyways. I don't suppose, Yo-Yo, you, you counted exactly how many egg submissions we've gotten. Because there's going to be a lot of eggs to choose from when I start that playthrough. Um... Yeah, let's activate the Teddy Toll. And then we're gonna go Pot of Greed. Ooh, Curse of Darkness. Chumley doesn't really play spells, though, but... Mmm... I wanna reset that for next time, though, but... Do I wanna put this down? I kinda do. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. He has some. Like, polymerization. <laughs> Hit him for a thousand and he hits me with Master of Oz. Ah, oh, there it is. His other spell. See? I made a good call. I made a big brain. He's attacking with Nimble Mamanga. I feel insulted. I got an idea. I got an idea. Send that back to his hand. <laughs> the AI does not react to Curse of Darkness. Exciting. Another Teddy Toll? Don't mind if I do. 
I may take a thousand damage, but you're gonna pay a thousand to attack. And should I just go Cyber Jar? No, Poison Mummy first. I'm not gonna attack him. Pay the toll. You wanna pass by through here, you better grease the, the bear paws with a little bit of honey, you know what I'm saying? You know how they say money talks? Well, in, in the case of Teddy Ursa, honey talks. Okay, we got Skull Invitation. Do I just put down Cyber Jar and watch shenanigans unfold? Of course I should. Why wouldn't I do that? And now we flip up the Skull Invitation. He's attacking with Nimble Manga again. I might take a little bit of a burn here, too. Kangaroo Champ. Bubonic Vermin. Ugh. I tell you, when I was dragging, like, the old oven from the spot upstairs earlier, I was, like, terrified that, like, a little mouse or something was gonna come running out of it, because, ugh. That's the, that's the thing I dread the most about moving crap out of its eternal spot in the living room kitchens areas. You understood some of those words, right? I hope you did. Oh, did he just... Oh, okay. The AI doesn't even account for for uh, Curse of Darkness when it costs them the game. That's so great. There's a total of 94 eggs submitted so far. Okay, that's pretty good. There is no chance in hell I'll be able to use all of them, even if I, even if I like, play absolutely terribly. There's no way. You again? Wait a minute, I could use you. Cause some trouble or do something, uh, wacked. Wait, wait, did he mean to say wicked? Is that what he's supposed to be saying? How about eating all the food in the dorm? Or like a big food fight, I bet you can do it. Then Detective Chaz will cause the, uh, solve the case in a flash. But make sure you leave my food alone. Oh, that won't make you uh, a suspect. A duel. Yeah, the white coat isn't even relevant to Tag Force 1. None of this, none of that Society of Light stuff happens at all in Tag Force 1. I'm not even sure if Tag Force 2 gets into it. Tag Force 2 has, um, ha has, like, Jesse on the cover, the Crystal Beast dude. Tag Force 3 is the one that's more based on, like, the, the season that wasn't, like, dubbed by 4Kids, right? It has an English release in Europe, though, so we I can play it that way. I wonder if the European translation would be better anyway, with how many spelling mistakes I've noticed in this. Okay, set that down. I guess I'll go Poison Mummy. All right, Kamakiri Strat, that's fine. Skull Invitation. I wasn't holding down the button to flip it, that's okay. Hundred. Okay, activate the Teddy Toll. The burn deck is very fun and just just surprisingly effective. So it's why I always kind of default end up playing with it for a few episodes. But I I take a break and I'll play like Elemental Heroes. And recently I did the X Y Z monsters. Those were fun. But I find that once you play a deck for a little bit, that starts to get repetitive too. The burn is just amusing in its own way for longer. Uh, I'm just trying to decide here. I guess I'll go with this. He only has one spell. There's not really much to consider. I got Skull Invitation. Oh. Okay. Go on, bro. Go on, bro. Come on. Hit me. Show me what you got. Heck yeah. Okay, he's activating the thing. Now, does this thing's... Let's see here, destroy all face-up monsters. Okay, so you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna throw down Penguin uh, Soldier and flip it back to his hand. 
I can also alternatively just use Cyber Jar. But you know what I mean. I wonder if it'd be a good idea to bring you back just to set you again. Nah. Unnecessary. Kamakiri number one. Level modulation. Oh, yeah. I get to draw two cards for that, bro. Nice. Okay. Make the effect. I was just playing Pokemon Emerald. So... Let's see here. Wait a second. Why is it... Wait a second. When it says return to the hand, does that... Can I not select that because it came from the graveyard? Is that why that's highlighted like that? Or is there some other stipulation on this? Going to some special summon cannot attack nor activate and apply its effect this turn. Hmm. Oh, it mean it that just means its effect is negated. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I for yeah, that's what that is. I thought it meant like no, you can't select it for Penguin Soldier. Otherwise, it wouldn't have had the yellow outline. Okay. I was confused for a second. Knowing the wording of Yu-Gi-Oh! That totally could be a real effect in Yu-Gi-Oh! Where it came from the graveyard, so you can't return it to the hand. You can't blame me for thinking that. With how this game is sometimes. Anyways. I booped it back to the hand. Save Lightning Vortex and Cyber Jar. So let's just burn through the princess, why don't we? Hit him for the extra damage while he tries to attack me. Oh! That is unfortunate. There are cards that actually do that, so I get ya. Unsurprising. You know, I seen a thing the other day. I've talked about the card Elemental Hero Rampart Blaster, which is the fusion for Clayman and Burstinatrix. Apparently that card had four erratas that make it work, like, very differently e each time. So when I say, like, it's because of that weird wording of its effect where it can attack while in defense mode. It is so ridiculous. Hmm. Should be fine to just throw down Yomi ship. He's probably gonna tribute Mass Dragon and throw down, like, level 5 and attack into it. We'll do that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure for Rampart Blaster, the card ended up working differently at, between Japan and North America because, because of the way the card was worded in each region. So silly. Anyways, he fell for my ruse. Pay the Teddy Toll. If I had a Teddy Ursa, I would, like, make it run a toll booth. That would be wholesome. But I feel like that vi would violate some kind of labor law if I think about it. So maybe I shouldn't do that. You didn't hear anything, right, chat? You heard nothing. Anyways, I guess I should just throw down Cyber Jar. He's about to die anyway. Oh yeah, English is such a silly language. I feel bad for translators sometimes because English just has like a bunch of ridiculous rules that no other language like like it would have any kind of equivalent. All right, I guess I'll just throw you down, too. I I have heard that English is one of the hardest languages to learn as a second language. Did he just make Ojama King? He also just lost because he sent three cards to the graveyard. That is... That is a very Ojama tactic right there. <laughs> If you think even slightly about how English is, you, your brain starts to hurt. For example, have you ever questioned why, the, when you say the number one, why is it spelled O-N-E? Like, why? You ever stop and think about that? No, you just accept it. We, we just accept that it makes no sense. Why, why is it not pronounced own? No, we say one. 
Yeah, I bet you never thought about that before. Ruining your minds now. <laughs> okay, he changed location. Let's go talk to Zane, though. He's have He has hearts. Okay, same thing here. He had a great talk. Don't really need to duel him. I should see if I can get a gold sandwich. Do I even have one on me right now? Come to think of it? No, I don't. Uh, yeah, give me sandwiches. Don't see it. Come on. Yeah, plain sandwich. That's good for Zane. Cupid Kiss. Must be one of, like, uh, Blair's cards. Okay, let me see what we got here. Don't see it again. God, a lot of these are garbage now. Alright, have too many. Still gotta get my points up. I don't think Maiden in Love ever got a real, like, real cards, did it? According to what people were saying. There's Dragon. There's Chaz again. I don't know if I have anything he wants. That's why I get to school early. He was saying something different, sorry. I must have just increased his hearts enough to see something different. A great talk. Um, he hated the salads, I'm pretty sure. I think. He doesn't like the plate. I don't have anything for him, honestly. You know what, I'm gonna take a chance. Take the soybeans. Wow, he actually likes the soybeans. I'm honestly shocked. I didn't expect that to work. Absolute spell defense. No way. Weeping King. Steel Beauty. I fought this person before? Twice, apparently. We don't recognize them. First to go. Here we go. Steel Beauty. What does he got? Okay, I don't really have my back row set up, so let's just go ahead and throw down Poison Mummy. Brawling Dragon number two. Oh, that's what number two looks like. Maiden Love was in, uh, Duel Links outside of the Tag Force games? Okay. Well, Duel Links is all about appeal appealing to the anime fans. Doesn't shock me that much. Hmm. I'll throw down Lightning Vortex next turn. Because he's getting monsters up. Oh, just one. Okay, I can keep stalling, apparently. Burn him for a little more. Crawling Dragon is a dinosaur? Wait, what, what, what is it? Oh, it is! Why? Bothers me. Oh, and Cybersaurus is a uh, machine. I'm making it be machine or dino. Anyways, infuse them. Got that. Wait, did you even activate polymerization or is this fusion just let you do that? I guess so. Okay, this guy can't even beat over Poison Mummy. I have nothing to fear. I may as well just do this. <laughs> the dragon isn't even crawling. Oh my god. When will the lies stop, Konami? Oh wow. <laughs> nice. A little extra damage on that one. I, 
I wish I had Skull Invitation to combo with that. I may as well just put down the Penguin and cheese his fusion back. I don't even need to Lightning Vortex. This is sweet. Crawling Dragon number two. Activate the effect. First, we boop you. Excellent. What's also funny about Falsebound Kingdom is that some of the monsters, like, the weird censorship on them, where they change, like, their cannons or guns or something to, like, uh, bright orange, green, and blue, um, they keep that on the monster models, but, because like, the text in that game is clearly not, like, held back. Like, Kaiba talks about, like, there's talk of, like, executing people. Kaiba's just, like, straight up says he's gonna kill someone. Like, they, they don't stop that. But they make sure that the Cyber Soldier dude has, like, the Nerf gun. It's so stupid. Oh, pardon me. I kept it over my words there. Um... Gosh. Wish I could just get... Ah, whatever. I'm gonna use you. Let's do that. I don't have my back row, like, at all. I got no Teddy Tolls. I got nothing. There goes that. That's another dinosaur. Two-headed King Rex plus Crawling Dragon number two makes a regular dino. Still makes no sense. So here's what we're gonna do. Do this, and then I'm gonna pick the penguin again, and I'm gonna do an epic prank. Just watch. It'll be funny. Watch this. Oh wow, he actually attacked that. Maybe I should Lightning Vortex now. Um, actually, I have a new idea. Man, where is my back row? I got no back row. Come on. He'd be dead by now if I had, like, the Teddy Tolls or anything. Oh, he's going in. He's going in, chat. Super Roboriaro. Okay. Oh, wait, no, that's the Mermaid. The Mermaid was another card that was apparently, like, uh, changed in its North American artwork. I've seen that recently. Hang on. I think, like, hang on. Let me get... Highlight the card after this. The No You. Yeah, she doesn't have, a. Like, she doesn't have, like, that top in the Japanese artwork. Look it up. There we go. So now is a good time for Lightning Vortex, I would say. Hmm. I should just use Morphing Jar to refresh my hand, but I don't want to give up the two Needleworms. So let me get them down first. So maybe next time. Wait until my hand is absolutely empty. Refusion. Uh, oh no, don't pay 800 life points to bring out a useless monster. No, stop it! All right. Oh, there's the other one. I can just flip that back when he gets to it. Just, just wait. I'll use him up. I'm being greedy. I'm making this duel take too long because I refuse. Is he fusing again? Man, he's really getting those going. Hey, Burning Land, finally. And here we go. He's getting booped by bugs. No, Needleworm is an insect. Don't worry. Oh, look, I still don't have back row. What is this? Are all my good cards on the bottom? Two-headed King Rex. That's one of those old monsters that uh, is in False Bound. Please, come on. Anything. Oh, one Skull Invitation. 
I might as well just deck him out on pretty much. We do this. He's picking rare metal dragon. That's fine. That's fine. Now that we've done that. Set Penguin, we're about to bounce. Okay. He's going for it. Okay. Select target from the field. Bop you. Nice. I take a bit of damage too, but it's no big deal. Ooh, so sorry. I can't believe I made this dude de like nearly deck out. He's got one or points left. He's dead. All right. First, we flip the penguin. Do you yield, sir? You better. Okay, and what are you gonna do now, buddy? You swapped it for Super Robo Lady. So, all I have to do is end my turn and I win. This was interesting. <laughs> Barely any burn happening until the end here. Thanks for getting this up there, Nosfer. I appreciate it. Hmm. Two seventy-seven. I lost. Guess my deck needs some more work. And now I, I, I think I know why I don't duel you. Okay, Bastion's around here. I know I have sandwiches he likes, so I may as well give him crap. I still got some time before class. I have some great food. Remember, you're my partner in the tournament. Am I your partner now? You had a great talk. Have some garlic. Okay, worked out good. You know what? Let's burn him. Let's go for it. A duel? Sure. Stretch? Hang on. All right. Stretching makes me feel good. Here we are. Bastion's got a real strat in this one. Okay. Hmm, do I want to burn or bounce him first? Probably bounce him so it doesn't set up. This is gonna have monster spam, that's for sure. Luminous Spark, oh no. He's not doing it. Ooh. Am I really gonna go with two of these? Yes, I am. You know what? Why not? It's funny. Gravekeepers setting everything on fire. Hmm. Gotta guarantee that I get the lead here, so make sure he attacks that. Five hundred. Uh, sure, a priest. Card cannot be special summon. Cards return to the owner's hand in phase. Turn to normal summoner. Flip summon. This card can attack all your opponent's monsters on the field. Oh no, don't do that. <laughs> it can't even take out my monsters. Ooh, so sorry for the loss there. Losing all your cards off the top of your deck. Uh... Are we going to go back anyway, so may as well do this. And now he has no monsters. There we go. Hang on, did I miss another redeem? Let's see here. Oh, you did. Yeah, it got buried. <laughs> it got buried by the sub right after. Ah, I'm, so I'm not doing it on purpose, I swear. Let me get a drink. Here we 
There we go. That's good there. I hydrated. Don't worry. I am alive with... Uh-oh. Well, this certainly might change things. Oh, you poor thing. And now there were no monsters. Ooh, the teddy toll. You'll love to see it. Alright, now we activate this. I'm gonna put another Yomi ship back down. I'm pretty much set. This is great. I'm not really burning him, unfortunately. I just ended up milling him quite a bit. And posture check. Yep, don't worry, I'm sitting just fine. Like a good little teddy. Alright, can just throw that in the penguin. He doesn't seem to run Nobleman. The only person who I know for sure has that is Zane. He always top decks that crap, too. I guess I'll throw this thing down, but... Alright, let's flip it up. I can. I want to get more characters maxed out for affection today. So far, only Cyrus. It's a very long and tedious grind, but hey, y'all are enjoying it, so we're gonna keep going. Okay, send you back. Nice. Well, I guess I'm stuck waiting. Oh, monster zone's filled because you can't kill them. Attack Yomi ship. Alright. There goes that. Ooh, dark hole. Reset button. Hang on, I think I'm gonna sneeze. Okay, yeah, I, there we go. I did it. That messed me up a little bit. I'm good. Alright, attack. 500. Ooh. Losing a hundred there, that's fine. I got no. I don't think I really want to use no, but why not? He already used his heavy storm, so it makes no difference. Pay the cost. Hey, the teddy bear toll, mister. Oh boy, you are gonna run out of stuff soon, I promise you. Well, here's this. Nothing that makes much of a difference. Out of greed. Ooh, so sorry. Pay uh, the cost there, buddy. Don't need to negate that summon. He's going for it. He can only do one more attack. He pretty much lost. End on a spell card, that'd be funny. No. Ooh, chain energy. If I play this, he can't play any cards. <laughs> At all. From his hand, anyway. Makes m that doesn't make much of a difference, though. I just need something to finish him off now. Come on. Yeah, he can't do anything. I just need something to finish him off. Come on. He can't attack. Am I going to have to make him deck out? Probably. Cyber Jar. Time is running out, Bastion. Time is almost out. Make him 
makes no difference to put that down. Well, now we keep waiting. The name of the game is to make sure the opponent can't play. Alright, I just have to flip up Needleworm. I'm gonna have to deck him out. I don't have a way to finish him. Because obviously he's not gonna pay the co uh, cost to, um... Nah, it doesn't matter there. He's not gonna pay the cost to attack, because he physically can't. This might give me some extra duel points, at least. Maybe I should make the opposite of a burn deck sometime. Like, remember that guy who made, like, the life point gain deck? That could be funny. Gain a crap ton of life points. I wonder if that would go well with the idea of, like, Chainsaw Insect Mill. Ah, no way. Let me guard down. There you go, buddy. Okay, so we took him out. Bastion's taking longer to uh, increase affection for, though. Oh, isn't Atticus dreamy? Oh, we've seen this one like five times now. And the teacher gets weird, too. We're done with today's lesson. Okay, don't need the dual you. Uh, Alexis still needs to be maxed out. I don't really have anything for her. Great talk. No Nova. I have a plain sandwich for Zane. I may as well give him that. The regular bread with nothing. All about Slifer, he has friends, good for that. No one cares about Cyrus, though. Right. Oh! I meant to go down to items, but this is fine. I got a dual Zane. He's like one of the only few people in the game right now that can absolutely destroy the burn deck still. Okay, what do you got for me, boy? Turn one chain energy, nice. But I'm not turn one. Alright. Let's see what we can do here. Put down a princess. Let's use this for heavy storm or nobleman. And then we put down chain energy and watch the watch destruction unfold. Unleash Chaos. 500. Oh, look, there's Nobleman of Crossout. It would be better if I saved Solemn for Heavy Storm. Yeah. And he took all copies of Princess with it. Reflect Bounder. I'll get him next turn. This is what Dark Hole is for. This is what Dark Hole is for. Alright. Lost the lead a little bit. That's okay. Hmm. Set down Yomi ship. In case he wants to go with a Cyber Dragon first. I know he's waiting to do that. I know he's waiting to do that. Thanks to reset there, friend. Appreciate it. 35 months of teddies and moomins. Proto Cyber Dragon. I was almost right. Once it's on the field, uh, the, the effect says I'm right. Alright, not bad. Not bad. All that back row and Princess can't do a thing with it now. Let's set Penguin while we can. Hmm. It would be unwise to use Burning Land right now. doing. Uh-oh, I know what he's doing. I know what he's doing. Come on, go ahead, bro. Go on!
Yeah. Yeah, I will. And there he goes. Alright, that worked out. Hmm. Send up to keep bouncing him. Oh, I'm gonna run out of life points. There it is. Okay, just bounce him back. I keep stalling. It's gonna pay the cost. Oh, I got Curse of Darkness. I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to put down Curse of Darkness and hope the AI just goes big brain. We're gonna need a big brain moment here. Can we do it? I can't play many cards left now. Okay. Yes. AI went big brain. But now I'm wide open. If he... Yeah, I'm dead. If, I, if he attacks at anything, I have to do this. I have no choice. Crap. Oh boy. I can make one more play. Oh my god! <laughs> really? Zane wasn't having it. Oh no, the cyber jar. This could be the this could be the last card I could play. And I need I need the flip effects to finish them. I don't have much of a choice. All I have down is Needleworm, and that's not gonna do anything. Alright, chat. It's all up to Cyber Jar. Let's go. Come on. He's doing nothing. Okay, let's go. It says I'm winning. Heavy Storm would actually be good for me right now, honestly. What? I thought that was limited to one? Wow. Well then. Uh... We both can't play cards anymore. <laughs> Neither of us can play cards from our hands now, because we don't have enough life points. I have to wait for him to deck out now. <laughs> oh, okay. He's putting Reflect Slime out, I guess. There's really nothing I can do except just... Yeah. End my turn 20 freaking times now. <laughs> oh, this is gonna take- this is gonna take a little bit. <laughs> this is the stupidest victory I've ever had. There's literally nothing he can do, right? Unless he has a card that just gets discarded from his hand to burn me for like 350. Is this what it's like to play with Mystic Mine? He can't play a spell, though. He literally can't afford the cost of Chain Energy to play a card from his hand, so it, it doesn't let you. Even if the AI was dumb. You physically can't do that in that, ga in that game state. Let me see here. Like, it's the wording. Like, it says, must pay 500 points, so if you can't pay 500 points, you can't do it. But this one says each time a spell is activated. That means that, like, you can play it, but you will take the damage afterward. So, that's why.
This is exciting. This is very exciting. What a duel. What a duel. The wording on Toll is the same, yeah. Let's see. Like, and the wording for this, you, if you can't send a top card from the top of your deck, you literally can't even do that either. Must pay, yeah. That's how they do it. Turn bonus is going to be wild. I wonder if there's a bonus for no, both players doing nothing for 20 turns. Here we go. Here we go. Doesn't matter what either of us draw. It's just waiting for him to deck out. <laughs> Almost there. Almost there. I knew this was a possibility, but this is the first time it's actually happened. Don't want to accidentally hit surrender after all this. I can just flip Needleworm, honestly. Yeah. But at this point, I'm curious to see if the turn, but what the turn bonus will say. Like, I can end it right now, but... Yeah. Let's do this. There's nothing left for you to play. Was that Magician of Faith? Okay. Turn 60. Is this a record? I'm not sure if this is a new record or not. <laughs> this is so funny. All right, now to just end my turn. And I win. 65. 471. Duelist bonus. Turn bonus was 130. Wow. Still, it's much faster to just beat people quickly than do that. No special summon bonus. 10. You're better than I thought. Okay, alright. I meant to give him a sandwich before that happens. Yes, this is good. Thanks. Well, that worked out for me, didn't it? Alright, let's go talk to the Chaz. Where you at? Where you at? Obelisk, the elite and super elite. Don't you agree? Oh, it's you, Pharaoh. Okay. And now let's give him the fermented soybean. And now let's give him a duel. I can see if I can go ahead and get some uh, gold sandwiches the next time I visit the shop. I think I'm going to sneeze again. First to go. Ow. That was a painful one. Alright, I'm getting more monsters than back row lately, aren't I? Okay, just set Yomi ship. Set the burn. No, it's not a dating sim. The characters just blush when I give them gifts. And I have to do it every day. Yeah. Even Alexis, the only girl in the group, says I remind her a reminder of her brother when I maxed out her hearts. Um, should I do that? I guess I'll set this for now. 
Save Cyberjar when he gets level 7 on the field. I'll throw this down, because why not? Burning Land. I'm just from now remembering that idea of, like, the Teddy Ursus running around while everything's on fire. That is a not very wholesome idea, I can say that much. There I go. And hit him for a thousand now. Okay, Skull Invitation, and we'll put down this this guy so I can recycle Needle Worm now. This works out. It's kind of surprising how many different, like, strategies I, I end up kind of going for with the Burn deck. All of them very stupid and obnoxious to play against. Premature Burial. And I get completely destroyed by a Heavy Storm or Nobleman. Hang on, I'm gonna flip this now, because he's gonna start tributing, for sure. And I need to free up the back row. It's not close enough to worry about, um, finishing him off. 300. And now I can recycle Needleworm. Nice. I may have a bunch of monsters on board, but I can just throw down Cyberjar next turn, and just destroy the field and set up a bunch more flip monsters. He's getting milled. What's that card there? Oja Muscle? What's that? What's that? Oh, it's gone now. You got hit hard for that. And you can't beat over Yomi Ship. Darn, he has five on the field. I should have waited for just desserts, apparently. Well then. That's funny. Oja Muscle... Select one face-up Ojama King on the field. Destroy all monsters on the field that include Ojama and their card name except the selected Ojama King. Increase the attack of the selected Ojama King by a thousand points for each destroyed monsters. That's a whole lot of cards for, like, 2,000, 3,000 attack points. Especially when it's very specific for one specific monster that already takes a bunch of resources to get on the field in the first place. Uh, I guess you could... Does that combo with the tokens from Ojama Trio? That would kind of work. It's still too much resources for a whole lot of nothing. That sounds like a terrible idea. Oh, oh, whatever. He got rid of Ojama Green. There we are. Well, time to set down Cyberjar and watch Chaos Unleash. Come on, boy. Do something. Do something. Come on, have some fun. Have some fun. Here we go. Was that Snatch Steel? And I win. We have to go through this before it applies the effect of Skull Invitation. And he's already lost. He is already lost. <laughs> this is such a waste of time now. These are the funny interactions you can see happen. Excellent. Okay, 342. Possible, you're supposed to be a loser. Okay, so I got a good talk, I gave him a gift, I beat him in a duel. He should love me now, right? Let's go back to the store and buy some sandwiches. I'm really farming those duel points today. Thanks for the sub there, friend. Appreciate it. Okay, here we go. Don't see the gold. Tofu sandwich. Give that to Alexis. Another plain sandwich for Zane. Defense Maiden? What is that? What is that from? No gold sandwich. Dried mackerel, that's pretty much for Pharaoh. It's another card for Maiden in Love. Just anime girl with armor and giant shield.
Ah. Can get too much from that, apparently. All right, lads. Let's talk to you. Found this magic flask. Great talk. Do I have anything you want? Yeah, a chicken sandwich, I guess. I don't know what to give you. Oh, he hates it? Damn. How do you hate chicken? Everybody loves chicken. And a great talk. Sausage sandwich. Okay. I might as well give these to him. Because I don't... No one else wants them. They're just taking up space. His hearts are at max. Okay. Now I can buy some more now. 50 points. No gold. Sweet bean paste? I think... I think Chaz liked that one. No gold again. And another chicken sandwich. Alright, doesn't look like there's gonna be a gold one today. Let me beat up Chumley to make it up to him. Let's ruin his whole day. His whole night. I'm not sure if I'll be able to go the full three hours with this one today. I already just did a long session for Emerald Rogue before this. Again, though, I'm doing a longer stream than usual because I can't stream tomorrow now. Not unless the delivery people show up, like, as early as humanly possible, based on the time they gave me. Because if they do, I might have time to do a short stream in the evening, but too much of a window... Hang on now. I'm pretty much gonna have to sit in my living room in the middle of the day for a few hours waiting for them to show up. Nobody likes doing that. Um... I guess we'll put Yomi ship down. A nimble Mamanga. Unfortunately for you, not nimble enough. He lost his polymerization, wow. A princess. Guaranteed a thousand on that hit right there. Don't really need swords this duel to stall. Eubonic vermin. Here they come. Pardon me, I was just getting a drink. Throat's a bit dry. MST. Take a thousand. Just desserts would hit pretty hard right now. He's just gonna keep taking reflect damage at this point. He's attacking with the absolute weakest monsters. Surprise, surprise, he had another one ready. Oh, he summoned a koala. He's about to learn a cold, hard lesson right here. Ooh. <laughs> he probably just did an attack with this Yomi ship, but it's funnier to send it back to his hand. That's hilarious. Poor Chumley. You don't stand a chance. You don't know what you're doing. Hmm. Put down Penguin. He's probably going to sacrifice and throw the koala down again, so this will be funny. Epic prank. Watch this. Oh, no, he didn't do it. What's, what's wrong with you, dude? Oh, I didn't flip this up, so I missed the 300 on that discard. Oh, well. Send that back to his hand. And now he's got nothing. Okay, he just threw one back down. Makes very little difference. I need to refresh my hand at this point. So I'm just going to put you down. I don't really need Cyberjar against Chumley. Can't really do anything at this point. 
Trying to kill him quickly is what I'm trying to do. Put that up. And his whole hand goes away, so that's pretty good. Hit him for 1,800. Hit him 900, though. Mm, in case he wants to throw down that koala again, if he's got another one. Let's see. Activate this. We got MST. Hmm. I don't really want to use that yet, because Princess is here. He's got three back row. And more discard costs. This'll be funny. Okay, summon Kangaroo Champ. Silent Fiend. Ooh, he, he's actually gonna do it. Oh, wait, no, it goes to attack mode, or defense mode, that's right. Oh, oh my god, he's gonna do it! Come on, Chumley, do it. Do it, I dare you. Do it. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh my god, he's gonna take this with a hundred life points left. Oh my god. Now that, that is just rude. I'm scum. Complete scum for that. 309, really? 309? I deserve a little more for style on that one. Max damage bonus, 17. <laughs> yeah. Oh, darn, I lost. Yeah, that's right, you lost, because you're a loser. Beat him hard there. You're in the classroom still. May as well go talk to Bastion. Bastion needs a lot of catching up here. Okay, great talk. I should have a tofu sandwich for you. Alright, now let's duel him again. Grind some more points and some more affection. Why aren't you my best friend yet, Bastion? Somehow Cyrus is. Cyrus is just super easy to please, I suppose. Let's nice seat here. Okay, throw down the poison mummy. Throw down the gravekeeper servant. And that should be good. I might have to deck him out again because of the way his deck's set up. Alright. So sorry. Can't destroy me. Too strong. Ooh, Skelly Invitation. I'd love to see it. Guess I'll throw down Penguin Soldier, because why not? Another one's, another one's gone. 300. Hmm. I might as well return my own mummy here. Wait, what? Oh, right! He negates the flip effect. Oh, I completely forgot about that. Okay. That's slightly annoying, but whatever. Like, whatever I put down, he's just gonna attack the other thing, huh? What a pain. I guess I just have to defend for a little bit until I get more stuff. And I'm just gonna MST one of your back row there. I'm gonna send a Teddy over and give it a little boop. Oh no! Anything but that. Don't pay mo He discarded Lightning Vortex to stop that. That better be a real good card, Bastion.
All right then. All right. He really gave he really gave up lightning vortex for that. Okay, he lost a uh, bottomless trap hole. That's good. Okay, this one still goes off from the wording, I suppose. All right, this will actually work. Seven tools of the bandit discard. Do that. And perfect. He summons it right back. Fantastic. Well, may as well put this down now. <laughs> Here we go again. Yeah, yeah, select, a select an attribute. Other Blade Knight got sent back. Doesn't matter, not like it could do anything anyway. Ooh, Princess, okay, good. Throw that down and get Penguin back, but he's just gonna attack it with the Blade Knight and Penguin's effect won't go off. It's so annoying. That Blade Knight caused some issues with my plan. If only I had more ways to make him pay instead of one Gravekeeper Servant. I'm burning him, but only a little bit at a time now. We use this to get uh, What's-Her-Face back. Oh, this will work out just fine, actually. Oh. He's using another magic jammer. Okay. Alright, what do I care? Be really bad if he magic jammered Dark Hole, so better to use him up like this. And now we end turn. Okay, let's flip this up. Oh, goodness. That's unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate. What are you doing? What are you doing? You think you're going all in with me? Wow. The disrespect hitting me with Marshmallow. Okay, bro. Okay, bro. Okay, bro. How about this? How about this? Now, no one gets to have fun. Ha happy? Happy? Hope you are. Oh, crap. He's gonna hit me a little bit with this now. Right, we both got really got no cards left. I really need a good draw or it's over. Okay, I can work with this. Bounce it back, and he's got to pay to send it out again. One. He's tributing. Ooh. Okay. Don't have much of a choice now. Well then, we've reached another <laughs> bit of an awkward situation, haven't we? I got more life points than him. Ooh, you can play two more. You can only play one more card, Bastion. Oh, I'm so sorry. You can't play. You can't play monsters, my dude. You've lost. Game over. with the chains. He's tr he's really trying this again. Well then. He can't play he can't play any cards from his hand, but I can. I just won. Draw 
draw a card, get burned, and that's that. 289. Okay, got him. How have I not maxed out another person's hearts yet? That's so ridiculous. Might as well go home and go to bed. Let me see here. Check the database. It's a duelist. Oh, tomorrow's a tag duel day. Um, Jaden's is, oh, oh my good, you know what's missing? Jaden's, uh, heart, final heart doesn't have the shadow on the right side. It's literally a pixel away, I'm not even kidding. Wow. Chumley's about there, Alexis is nearly there, Chaz is absolutely getting there. Bastion's still on his last heart. Zane is, wait, Zane has the shadow. Zane is at max. He hasn't given me a, a reward, though. Okay, I guess I gotta talk to him again, maybe. What will it show up at? If I go to the store right now, will it show both uh, Cyrus's and Zane's packs, though? I'm curious. Let me check that. Okay, yeah. It has Zane and Cyrus. So Zane is confirmed to be fully f fully uh, upgraded there. That's good. That's the case. Let me just go find Zane. He might have special dialogue if I talk to him again. No, oh, I did want to go see Bastion. Nobody wants to talk to Bastion. And he moved, which that that's good, honestly. Anybody around? Hi. This is for you. Power Bond. Oh, I already had one of those. It's not that good, man. Oh, he's not gonna say anything else? Too cool, my dude. Too cool. All right. All right. So the Truesdale brothers will love me. Hmm. Maybe I should duel Lexus. Yeah, it's Dueler. A duel sounds great. If only I could get my hands on another gold sandwich, but that's not really showing up. Star of the Silver Screen. We'll see about that. It's all about to be burned down yet again. Hmm. I should probably start with swords. Stall for more stuff. Let her build up her back row. And we're gonna activate Curse of Darkness right away. We're gonna hope that she... just feeds into it. Okay, nothing there. Why would there be? Because you have no reason to attack. Or put anything in attack mode, I should say, because of swords. Ooh, the Teddy Toll! You'd love to see it. I gotta pay life points, but don't worry. I'm confident I'll be catching up. I'll play a spell card. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, a second princess, perfect. Okay, so slaughter should be ready to happen. Blade Skater. DD Warrior Lady. She's going in. She's going all in. Made a toll. And with that, <laughs> attack and receive. Oh no, 700 points of damage. That's so bad. Just got Yomi shipped. 
I told you that damage was coming for her. <laughs> Destroy that. Destroy you. And what do I have left? Another Yomi ship. I could just play Dark Hole and then set Penguin down, but that cost me a thousand to do that. I don't need to. She can't beat over Penguin. We're good. We're totally good. Go on, Alexis. What are you gonna do? Oh, you're attacking with the weak one again, you poor fool. Yeah, I knew you'd do that. <laughs> this is so funny. She just keeps attacking with her low attack monsters and taking bounce damage there. Well, there's one another one of these. It's kind of unnecessary, though. It'd be more of a detriment to me now. So I can just do this to get another monster on board for her to attack into. Alexis not playing super smart. Call the haunted. Oh, go go ahead. Make your call. Make your call. This is supposed to scare me. All I gotta do is put down Princess and I pretty much win. Completely win. Oh, you poor fool. Alexis, what was that? That was incredib incredibly poor performance. I can't be. I lost. Now I gotta get rid of class. Okay. I have to wait for her to change locations to talk again. I think I pretty much maxed out her hearts with that. So, does this mean Zane or Cyrus is going to show up at my dorm looking to be partners again? What happens when po when multiple people have it maxed out? Is it just random? Or what? Either way, we should do a little bit of tag dueling to uh, increase our, our points. And just binge spend again next time. No one's really going to move around for the rest of the night. So yeah, let's do some tag duels. I've had to skip a few weeks of it anyway. But it's a good opportunity to farm. Plus, it gives you a little bit, a bit of variety to see things. Okay, advanced time. Let's end the day. Oh, no. Sure. We'll play with Cyrus. Oh, man. Oh. God, it looks so lame walking around with Cyrus. Let's duel your brother. Come on, Cyrus. Show your brother what you're made out of here. I want to do the burn deck. It's still quick and easy right now. Farming all these points with the burn deck and then buy... Are, are, are we still really draw? Okay, there we go. How many draws was that? <laughs> I was like mashing while looking at chat. Okay. And here we go. Start duel. Come on, Cyrus. Show us what you got. Your turn one fusing? Okay. UFO Roid Fighter. Or your time monster fusion summon. Uh, is that Tempest on the artwork? Fusion between uh, the original attack defenses card become equal to the original is combined with uh, two fusion monsters. You use the finish summon this card. Okay. Wow. Now watch Alexis get rid of it somehow. Okay, it's my turn. Alright, my job is to provide support with my terrible monsters. And I hope they activate spell cards, and Cyrus doesn't. This would kind of flood the field. I'm not really going to get much out of that. Eli, set that. I'm scared to set this right away, because Cyrus might use it. You know what? I will activate this. Why not? Why shouldn't I be scum? We're going to activate this. Then we're gonna activate this. 
For the love of God, when you activate limiter removal, you better make it count. Oh. Oh, oh. Wait for it. Wait for it. <laughs> but problem is, Jinzo's also a machine, so it doesn't work. On your side of the field. Okay, never mind. Never mind. You declare it battle, so activate it now. Well, well, well. Look what happened here. He's summoning Cyber Dragon now. Well, there goes that, but nobody can really do about it. Put Gyroid down. Command Knight. Ooh, they're attacking. Ooh, attacking the Gyroid. Gravekeeper Servant there. Yep, let that go off. Didn't take damage from activating limiter removal because of Jinzo. Uh, did I? Limiter removal is a spell, though. I think you're thinking of Power Bond that does uh, the damage. Limiter removal just destroys the monster at the end of the turn. Okay, so let's set this and let's activate Chain Energy and watch the tears flow. Hang on, let me check this. Yeah, limiter removal has nothing to do with the uh, taking damage part. That's power bond. There we go. Next turn. Oh, didn't take skull damage. Sorry. Okay, I misread you there. Yeah, the skull invitation damage because of that, I suppose. That's what you were talking about. Sorry. I completely missed the word skull in there. I thought you were talking about, like, power bonds damage of just making you, uh, take damage for the double attack power. Not that it really matters, though. It only saves me 300 points. Flip up the Omi ship. There we go. Listen, so many cards, uh, cards there. Yeah, I didn't take any damage from the Curse of Darkness from flipping up limiter removal, yeah. Okay. Let's just get rid of the Cyber Dragon here. Wait, what? Really? You pay- you paid the life point cost for that? Oh, you idiot. <laughs> no, no, Cyrus, just end the turn. They can't win. They can't win. Did they just... Good job. Good job. Wow. We actually beat them. New high score? What's the new one? New bonus, total deflected damage. <laughs> okay. Alright, we take that. Not bad. All right, should we get cocky and keep fighting? We should. Warrior recruit, oh no, not you. I hate you. Oh yeah, you two are partners now? How funny, let's duel them. I don't think you can really get affection her heart increases on Tag Duel Day, right? Now, can your weak and strong deck actually combo with Bastion? I don't think so. It's really having any search targets on Mass Dragon on Bastion's deck. Oh, no, he's playing the waifu. Cyrus, no. No, let's not lose to the waifu. He's stealing your waifu! Are you just gonna take that? 
wow. Apparently you are. Okay, what did he set? Just desserts. Hey, that's actually good for me. Thanks, Cyrus. All right, then. Can set that down. Hmm. Let's just throw down Needleworm. And activate this. And we're gonna go ahead and flip up Skull Invitation. Heart of Greed. There it goes again. Don't gotta play anything. Luminous Spark. Uh-oh. He's taking... He's he's taking that waifu to full power. Oh, no! He's actually using it! Hang on. This is what this is for. Can't attack... Can't let Cyrus attack with Fleck Bounder. No need to do that. Cyrus just gave them a huge beater for free. <laughs> yeah. Alright, this is still fine. You got swords, play it. Just play swords, man. At least playing with Cyrus is different than playing with Jaden for like the 10,000th time. What are you doing? Uh, okay, that actually worked. I'm surprised. You made him waste Magic Jammer on that? <laughs> That's hilarious. Hundred. Okay, good. You played the swords. Swords of Light will protect us from uh, Thunder Girl. And there she goes. He baited the magic jammer so he could play swords. Oh my god. There's no way the AI did that on purpose. The AI was not smart enough to do that. There's no way. There's no way. Cyrus AI already working better than Jaden's AI. Oh no! He got his own waifu on the field! Ugh. He's flipping that now. He's going for the thousand damage. Sep- Oh. <laughs> oh no, he's gonna pay a thousand so he doesn't take a thousand. <laughs> okay. Good job, AI. <laughs> That's a funny interaction. Oh, and more cards went to the graveyard, so he took more damage anyway. That was hilarious. 1,000 IQ play. Oh, that's unfortunate. We have swords. Reset. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stay oh, boy. Oh, he did... Okay. That sword's held out just long enough. Luckily, I've got swords as well. Ooh, I'm gonna have to do it. Um, I'm gonna have to boop their field spell. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Just in case. Goes to the graveyard, but that's alright. Bernie Land's almost gonna do this. Made swords. Now function, pay 500 life points. Oh, flipping that up was actually kind of bad. Uh oh. I really hope you don't activate that, Cyrus, because it doesn't do anything. Do not activate the effect. Oh, we can't. It's Bastion's turn. All right. All you gotta do is end your turn, Cyrus, and we win. Just end your turn. Cyrus, just end the turn. You, you stole my penguin? What, what are you doing? Just end your turn. We win. 
There we go. Three forty-nine. Wow, Cyrus is actually helping. I'm shocked. Okay, who else should we duel? SF set. I kind of want to get revenge against these two. Those losses are from another tag duel day. All right, let's give it a go. Or you recruit flying insects. Here we go. Flying discus and water. Oh, I got water all right. On command night. Okay, you're going first. Fate doll. Well, we know we got MST now. That's great. Okay, this is fine. Oh, you wasted a dark hole on that? Well, whatever. What you have down? And you're bringing it back. Uh-oh. Well, we knew that was coming. What a shame. Flip in the dust, Tornado. Royal Decree. Okay. Well then. Is this still... Yeah, it's not gonna go off now. That's a problem for my deck. Luckily, I don't have my trap cards, only spells. Hmm. Yomi's ship should be fine to throw down. We'll do this. From the graveyard, we just have his lad there. We don't need that. Hmm. We lost a bit of life points right away. If I set this, he'd probably use it. Better he discard than me, so I'll do that. And I'll activate this. And we'll end my turn. Unfortunately, there's not a whole lot I could do to con really contribute here. He did more than me. Marauding Captain. Uh-oh, the tomato. Did I get rid of United We Stand? Okay, that's good. None of them can beat over Yomi Ship. This is great. Ooh, Cylinder. Except that doesn't work with Royal Decree on the field. Yeah, I knew he'd do that. Nice. Wait, wait, what are you doing? Don't attack with Yomi Ship, you idiot! Well, it is Yomi Ship. I suppose, you know, I suppose that's not the worst idea. He had Magic Cylinder. I can't complain. He's baiting the attack. Wait, what? You didn't flip Cylinder for that? I thought that was your plan. Well, I guess not. Wants to save for something stronger. All right, then. Um, I guess I'll just throw down another Yomi Ship. All the day. I don't want to give them anything with that. Oh, right, Royal Decree. I just said that out loud, and I didn't... Yeah, you're right. I literally said that out loud, and my brain immediately forgot it. Never mind. I'm the one that's dumb here. Okay, end turn. Uh-oh. That's a problem. We're gonna have to activate this. And cover the field with uh, goats for a second. I want plushies of these still. Premature burial. Unleash the goats. It's like unleashing the bears. Oh? Uh-oh. Well, it's not like there's much of a difference here. Can't use magic cylinder. All you can do is that, unfortunately. Cyrus is out of options. He did all he, all he could. 
Sand Gan. Oh, that's great. What am I gonna do? Make him deck out? Last pawn agreed. Two layers of trap negation, yeah. Last chance to stall. I can make them pay the teddy toll. Will that be enough, though? Uh, I'm gonna have to activate this, and hang on. I'm gonna have to bring back Yomi ship and hope he attacks into it with Jinzo as well. More bodies for the toll to drain them, but they get to bring back stuff too, but it's like, I don't really got much of a choice, do I? Command Knight? Yeah, it's fine. Could've been worse. Okay, we're gonna set this. Activate the teddy bear toll. You wanna play with the lambs? You deposit all the cookies into the bear's palms. Might have a chance at this. Might be able to get their life points low enough that the burn will kill them. And a cost. Okay, Jinzo didn't attack that one, so... Is that another royal decree? It is. Oh, no! Take okay, they take the burn. They- they can't afford to kill us. We're- we're, we're safe. Oh, no. Paying the cost. Paying the toll. Oh my god, we won. We won. <laughs> we actually won. Just end your turn and we win now. Oh, well, I'm the one who drew it. Okay. Teddy Toll does it again. Taxation. Absolutely slaughtered. Having some fun interactions with the, uh, the burn deck today, aren't we? So what's the new high score I got? Number of tokens... <laughs> Have I just never activated Scapegoat before? I guess I haven't. Oh well. Take that. No one is safe from the Teddy Toll. Not even you. There we go. Absolute spell defense. True path trap removal. Looking Saturn. Just looking Saturn. Hang on. Are you the sinking strength? Oh, not not the skill drain guy. I refuse. You can't make me play against him. Oh, you two. Ruler of Beyond. Phoenix's Dream. Eh. Swift deck. Final duel. Patience is a virtue. Oh god, I hate these people. Let's duel one of them. I'm the only one that's allowed to play the dumb, annoying deck. Only me. Anyone else that does it is a cheater. And they're lame. I was the one that made it go in style. And here we go. Hey, let's go. Doesn't have a warrior. Stand by. Ooh, Breaker the Magical Warrior. Ooh, you got him. Just one. Alright, this looks like it'll be a pretty clean one. He's got Gyroid there. Gyroid's actually really good for my deck, because it kind of stalls the opponent a bit. So we'll put this down. I'm scared to put this down right away. I don't want Cyrus activating it on something stupid. Skull Invitation. What? Really? Use a dark hole on that, whatever. I don't even care. Ooh, the tricky. 
Things are about to get real tricky now. They're going for that that single hit. Okay, you got swords. That's good. We can stall and set up a little bit now. I don't know. I don't understand how Cyrus is a... Oh, great. How Cyrus... You know, maybe I should have put Solemn Judgment down after all, but whatever. Yeah. Cyrus is a way better dual partner than Jaden is, that's for sure. So, yeah, we kind of got uh, beat up pretty badly. Time for me to use my own Dark Hole. If you activate Magic Jammer, so help me. There we go, that's what I thought. Now I better set this, and we'll set you for defense first. And bounce whatever strong thing they throw out. RP Laney 1. Premature Burial. Bringing that thing back will, in fact, let it keep all its stupid thing, stupid stats. Do I want to let that happen? Or do I... If I bounce it back to his hand, he won't be able to do that. I feel like I should save this, so I'll do it. Okay, good. He attacked just like I thought with that one. And now we bounce this. Heck yes. We got an MST. Shining Angel. Okay. Ooh, so sorry. What is this thing? Jetroid? Let me, let me read that. What do we got here? At the time this card is selected as an attack target by your opponent's monster, the controller of this card can activate trap cards from their hand. Huh. Never heard of this one. Isn't active being able to activate card trap cards from your hand during an attack really good in modern Yu-Gi-Oh? So, I, I don't think this card is very good in modern decks, but I don't know. I mean, it only works if it's face down. Your opponent can read the card, obviously. But, huh. Whatever, I put that down. Battle effects are really bad, so it evens out. Okay. Oh my goodness! His partner got his heavy storm. No, 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 no. Not today. Not again. The old man says no. We shall not have another storm. There's enough hand traps that don't require a roid on the field. Yeah. Oh my goodness, stop it. Well then. Do I want to boop his back row there? I think I will. What was it? Last turn. What? You have last turn? Oh no, good thing I got rid of that. Cyrus, don't. Don't. What? What? what mm, okay. Oh boy. I wouldn't want to deal with last turn in a tag duel. That sounds like a nightmare. That could have been so bad. Can you imagine losing to that in this game? Also, yeah, can't use burning. Is that... Hmm. My spear cretin. I don't have cyber jar. I haven't drawn that for a bit. Great. They can't beat over poison mummy. That could easily change. All I can really do is set Yomi ship and pray in this situation. Luster Dragon. Oh, no. Nice. I wasted it. Oh, we... We're gonna have 200 life points left. We're pretty much dead. It's all up to Cyrus. I couldn't do, what I, do anything. What? Oh, you can't even play those. Too high level. Well, we lose. <laughs> Unfortunate, but we tried our best. Cyrus just bricked there, so... The UFO's too high level. It's fusion fodder. I don't run warriors, Cyrus, so I don't know what you want me to do. Okay. Nova and that guy. Nova's good for points. 
Oh boy. Thanks for gifting us up there, Three Clovers. Appreciate that. When I check the when I update the sub goal counter at the end of today's stream, I get the feeling we're gonna be reasonably close to Dark Souls now. We're breezing through those sub goals, and it's only been the first couple days of the month. Apparently I should have set th things higher, but I thought it was already too high. Maybe next month we'll we'll do that. I don't know. I don't wanna get that greedy. I gotta finish up the playthroughs of the the current reward tiers. Okay, pot of greed. DD Warrior Lady, flip that up. And she's gone. And so is our monster. Cyrus is doing way better as a tag partner than Jaden, that's for sure. Well, that's real unfortunate. We got smacked. Get a thousand life points back, though, at least. Three thousand. All right. Start with Pot Agree. Don't Magic Jammer. Hmm. Okay, put down this. Hmm. Princess would... But you can defend over this. Hang on, actually. Oh, right. This effect. Yeah, fire points during the damage step. So he's gonna beat over Poison Mummy anyway. May as well throw you down. Set Curse of Darkness. See what we can do. Told you. Your mods told you. Well, okay, then. I'll make the reward tiers higher next time, but we can't- we shouldn't do another subathon until after I finish the promised playthroughs like the Egglock and Dark Souls, which we're probably going to reach. But we shall get to that. Yeah. There goes Thunder Dragon. And the Princess. Come on, attack it. Come on. It's only 500 now, but whatever. Don't need Call of the Haunted. Huh, because he got rid of, the, like, the, the train guy, now we can pretty easily just do this. Put that up there. No, I'm not really looking to do any farming games right now. Those are super hit or miss when I stream them now. Okay, beat over that. People want to see funny internet man do wacky stuff. Heck yeah. That's how it goes. Good goblin housekeeping. Limited to two. You can't even take full advantage of it. Okay, he's thrown down swords. Fortunately, that's going to cost you, boyo. Hmm, I got Skull Invitation up now, so may as well throw down Needleworm. Poison Mummy will just be- man, my stomach just rumbled a bit there. I'm hungry. You're tributing for Thunder Dragon? Why would you do that? What's that? Discard one card from your hand, select one card in your graveyard, turn to the top of your deck. He really wants his Thunder Dragons. This is the most bizarre play I've ever seen. He put Thunder Dragon on top of his deck for some reason. <laughs> there goes that. Well then. You're flipping that up, are ya? Better have a plan. Plan better not be activating swords. Oh, you tributed it. Not bad. Okay, I'll, 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 let, I'll allow that. That's fine. At least he flipped it first. Fortunately, he let Curse of Darkness go off for us. UFO Roid is a recruiter. That's freaking uh, six stars. That's so bad. Well, at this point, I may as well just put down Poison Mummy and get ready to just flip for flip for game. I'm pretty sure I get to choose my partner for part two. Oh, you just... Well then. Curse of Darkness to activate that. Poor fool. <laughs> Game over for them. 390. 
All right, one more tag duel and I should go home for the day. How about just beating up these two? Victory lap. Progress for today has been getting Cyrus's, uh, no, not Cyrus, Zane's hearts maxed out. I'm pretty sure Alexis is there too. I just need to talk to her again. In the phase, draw the friends. Throwing Jetroid down. Uh oh. Why would you do that, bro? <laughs> no, I could have told you that wouldn't have worked. Too weak. Nudoria. Uh oh. Oh, he was baiting the cylinder. I mean, I guess that's a little bit of damage, but really worth it? Yeah, whatever, he lived. May as well put this thing in defense mode now. Hang on a second, I have an idea. I have an idea. Lose my summon for the turn, but whatever. I could crash it into that, then he's forced to pick his own monster to uh, die there. I give up my summon to do that, though, but I can... No, I can... Main phase 2. What am I saying? It's not Duel Links. There's a main phase 2. Let me... Let me do that. Assuming his face down isn't something stupid. Back to activates. You have to choose a target. There goes her. And... Hmm. I guess Penguin's fine. I don't want to mess with Cyrus's hand. Yeah, end phase. Oh, good, good morning. Or evening. It's actually pretty late in the day, yeah. King's Knight. Legendary Sword. Oh, that's how you know it's a Sliper deck. He's playing old school quips. Divine Sword, Phoenix Blade. Only equip this card to warrior type monster. Increase attack 3 to points. If this card's in your graveyard during your main phase, by removing from play two warrior type monsters from your graveyard, add this card to your hand. Gotta bounce. Well then. He drew pot agreed. See, everything's fine. Everything is a-okay. He drew two UFO roids. Of course he did. May as well attack him. I fix my headphones here. Second. Oof, there we go. Take 500. Alright, I guess I could just throw down Princess. It's kind of got us covered with attack points there. Bombardment Beetle. Flip. Pick up and see one face down defense position monster your opponent's side of the field. If it's an effect monster, destroy it. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. Well, there goes Princess, and here comes Jack. This is not good. Oh boy, you got you can't really do anything, can you? Except premature burial. You should be able to beat over Jack with that, though. Ooh, he ain't messed around. He ain't messed around at all. Five hundred. Okay, he ended his turn. What was the face down again? Oh, that's his thing, that's right. Cliff, draw one card. I wonder how it just gets to do that. Okay, set the cylinder. I suppose I could just go for the attack. <laughs> There's no reason to stop, uh, not do that, I suppose. That was another Yomi ship. Alright. 
Oh, of course it wasn't enough. Let's see here. Toss coin. If you call it right, destroy most of your opponent's side of the field. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Flip a coin. And nothing. I went for the kill, but we didn't quite get it. Actually, I should have just played it safe and attacked with the other one, because then Burning Land would have finished them off. I didn't think about that. But this will finish them off. You win. 253. Alright, so I farmed a crap ton of points during this uh, session here. Let's see here. Any noise in the background there, sorry. Welcome to the special site. Go out special site. Goodbye! 3rd of July. Let's take a look at this now. Database, list of duelist. Jaden's still missing the shadow on his pixel there. Alexis is also missing the shadow, like literally a pixel away from having full meter. Jazz needs a bit more. Zane's at full. Okay, so yeah. These last, like the final heart is taking forever. What is with that? Like, is there some, like, mechanic in place that makes the last heart just take longer? Like, what gives? I feel like it's been three episodes and people have been on their last heart for that long. It's here. Why are you checking me up there? Didn't seem to like it. Well, I gotta give up a sandwich anyway, bro. So have the chicken sandwich that no one seems to like. Maybe I should see if I can get some sandwiches first. Time to buy! Yes. Boop. Soba noodle sandwich. I don't even know who likes that. I see a plain one. Oh, come on. I saw one stop on that. Now I get the crappy ham sandwich. I don't see the gold anywhere. Chocolate sandwich. I can give that to Alexis at least. Wait, I think um, Chaz also likes the chocolate sandwich, so I could probably just give that to him instead. Alexis is pretty much done. Oh, goodness, I just barely missed it again. Oh, I have a lot of garbage sandwiches after that. It's pretty lame. I gotta farm everyone's character packs once I get all that, uh, that maxed out as well. Mm, you know what I could do, actually, is just give... Who likes even likes ham sandwiches? I don't even know... Yeah, yeah, I'm your partner, bro. Had a great talk. Sweet bean paste. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I give that to Chaz, so I'll give you this. Okay, good. I constantly forget, like, who likes anything in this. Slide for dorm. I guess I'll just give the chocolate sandwich to her and talk to her, and she, she should give me her, like, final thing. I hope. Oh man, I love this. Okay, talk. Here, take this. You got the Cyber Blader card. We may become partners, you never know. I'm, I'm pretty sure we already are. Or is she talking about the different kind of partner? Talk. Alright, time to go to class. Okay, Alexis. 
Lexus is in a good mood today. Okay, so she's maxed out. That's another character done. You're over here. Don't need to talk to Zane anymore. Still pretty sure I can just give him a sweet bean paste. Yeah, but when you're uh, as high up in society as I am, you have many important tasks before class. Feeding the rabbits, watering the flowers. That's why I get to school early. He's feeding the bunnies. You want to hear my story, huh? You had a great talk. Sweet bean paste. Please work. Please don't let me be wrong. Okay, yeah. That's good. Still need to get myself a gold sandwich. Maybe Chaz isn't so, the ba so bad after all. He wants to feed the bunnies. The baby bum buns. Oops, I hit the button by accident there. Fifty DP. Man, I haven't seen a single gold sandwich on the roulette today. Destiny sandwich. Ah, the destiny sandwich never works out for me, ever. Still no gold cheese sandwich. Please give me something Chaz likes in general. Oh, yeah, I used up. I talked to Jaden. 7.30. Should be fine to just talk to them normally and go start class. And a great talk. We're still on for the tournament. Yes, we are. We'll probably just do one duel against Chumley. Because, like, I should be super close. And then the only people that I really need to, like, uh, level up anymore is just Bastion and Chaz. Lots of duelings for Chaz. Oops, I thought I hit the button. Animal mayhem. We're gonna have lots of mayhem. Okay, set that. Put the penguin down. Watch Chaos Unleash. It's Chumley, so he's gonna hit me into something there. Don't need the Needle Worm turn one. Yeah, that's what I thought. Three hundred and bounce it back. I hope when he if he gets Master of Oz, I have Magic Cylinder down again. Not much in the way of back row except for Skull Invitation, but whatever. Okay, take 1,500. Beautiful. Okay, posture check. Yeah, hang on. Let me just fix my seat here. Okay, give me the Teddy Tolls, please. There we go. Thank you. I feel like Teddy Toll hasn't really happened as much this episode as it normally does. I don't seem to be drawing it frequently. I guess I'll just put down Yomi Ship, yeah. Yeah, we get a drink. We're past two hours with this. Um, yeah, a second. 1500. Do I just go for it? I think I'm just gonna go for it. MST. We don't need that because we got Princess. That down. Yomi ship he's going to attack into and lose. Pay in the toll. Anyways, what was I just thinking there? I'm probably just going to wrap it up in a little bit and call the night. I would wish I could go a little bit longer, but it's more about 
<laughs> doing a long stream today just so I have things to upload. Hopefully when I'm back again on the weekend, we can just relax, continue all the other games, and I can be having a nice dinner with my new oven. That's what I'm hoping for. Mm, I'll set this. Don't really need Cyber Jar. I'd rather refresh my hand. He's not going to have too much left for him. There it goes. Lose a bit more life points on that. 1,200. Yeah, attack the princess. Oh, I won. I just have to flip up princess and I win. You'll love to see it. There we go. 228. Oh, darn, I lost. Okay, I talked to him. Jaden's there. Now it's just time to go to class. Any new events? Morning, kids. Oh, is that Professor Charter's class today? He ate 10 day old curry and got sick. That's just like him to do that. No, it's the one where they just say his name wrong. Uh -huh. We're done with today's lesson. Okay, Alexis is fully maxed out. Don't gonna speak to her anymore, because I'm pretty sure it doesn't degrade. Now we just gotta find them. Oh, Jaden and Chumley are at the store. No gold sandwiches for me. Okay, this has to be enough. Here, take this. Miracle Fusion. Well, it's a little late for that, Jaden. I already got plenty. I use It's a card I use all the time. No, it isn't. We might hook up as partners someday. Make sure you throw that card in the deck if we do. That sounds like a bad idea. Splash it in to hope I can use it. Okay, Chumley still there. A little bit more maxing out to do for Chumley. I unload some crappy sandwiches on you. You like ham? You like ham? Have ham. I like this, thanks. Alright, let me buy some. Come on, please. I'm begging you. Give me the gold sandwich. I need that. Does Chaz like the jam sandwiches because he likes sweets? That might be worth giving to him for now, I guess. <sighs> well, he likes fermented soybeans as well, so that's something. Where's he at? There you are. Just gotta talk to him a bunch of times. Fermented soybean, because you like these, I know that for sure. Alright, now let's give him another duel. It seems like his hearts are still going up faster, even- but- I think I've given him at least three gold sandwiches. So that's three free hearts right there, which is good. Oh, I'm getting hungry. I gotta get myself some dinner soon. Hang on a second. I'm a little bit stuffy. Let me just reach over and grab this. There we go. Again, shorter session for today. But, no, I'll just put down Mummy. On the weekend, we'll do a lot more a lot more streaming again, for sure. Gotta make up for all that last time. I still gotta finish Pandora's Tower. I think I'm gonna do, like... I think I'm gonna make time to do that next stream, for sure, if I can. 
And I thought I held down the button to activate this, but I missed it. Oh well. Hit him for that sweet effect damage. Okay. That's Skull Invitation, so I can just throw down Needleworm. I need food! I'm a hungry teddy. 300. Let's get rid of that. Won't help you. You poor fool. All the damage. Oh, he's going for level 7 now. That means it's my cue to put down Penguin. Down the Penguin. Set up the Teddy Bear Toll. New oven photos. I don't need to take pictures of the new oven. Y'all don't even know what the old one looks like. Under there. The new oven is new, but it's not. It doesn't matter. Who cares what it looks like. It cooks food. That's what it'll do. Our dragon level seven. Penguin soldier. Okay, we should be good. Let's let it go. He magic jammered my toll, so no teddy bear tolls today. Oja muscle. So sorry, Chaz. You're gonna love this. Back you go. Let's see if this will give me anything else for the back row. MST. Yeah, I'll just set Penguin. I'm gonna break that back row there, just because... Oh, I almost pressed it on Skull Invitation. Like, my thumb was on the button, and I just almost... Ugh. Oh, wait, was that Oja Magic? Oh, come on. That was the worst thing I could have hit. Oh, wait, he doesn't have them. <laughs> he can't even add them to his hand. Unfortunate. Well, not much he can do now. Oh, he's flipping Cyberjar. Oh, whoopee! Come on, give me my monsters. Creature swap. Oh, no. No, 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 no. We don't want that. Lightning Vortex. Another Oja Magic. Okay, I'll take this. Can't let me vortex those things there, huh? Alright, I'll put this down. And, alright, fine, go ahead. Go ahead. You paid Oja Magic as a cost, so it doesn't activate. And there it goes again. Wait, what? That works? How? I thought, hang on. I thought even with that word, it doesn't count if you use if you discard it as a cost. I guess I'm wrong, it's a different type of thing. Well, whatever then, apparently. Let me summon this. I can make Curse of Darkness and let him ruin his life. I guess it was sent, but whatever. Ooh, that's gonna cost you, boyo. Play spell card. Oh, he thinks he's he thinks he's gonna attack. He thinks he's gonna beat me. Take the bounce. Take the bounce. 
Ooh. He can't even attack now. Oh, he- alright. Good job, bro. He just cost himself the game trying to summon level 7. Three ten. No, impossible. You're supposed to be a loser. Losers can't beat me. All right, that takes care of that. May as well go talk to Bastion. I don't feel like dueling Bastion. He always takes too long with this deck. Okay, he had a great talk. Item. Do I have anything for you? I have a plain sandwich for Zane, but. Ah, let's try the Destiny sandwich, whatever. Oh, he hated it. Well, that probably just reset a bit of progress. Unfortunate. Ah, what a pain. I guess I can give the plain sandwich to Zane because I literally it literally just takes up space in my inventory. I like how the implication is that you're just taking a bite out of a sandwich with like a card in there. Some cardboard sandwich. Cheap cardboard. To the store. Come on. You gotta have some gold sandwiches. There hasn't been a single one on the roulette today. It's been hours. Come on, Dorothy. Ah. Hamburger sandwich. Well, that sounds good. Oh. I see it. Oh. Close. All that and just tomatoes. And it's not there now. Lobster sandwich. Would that be something Chaz likes? Lobster's expensive, ain't it? I remember when I worked at a grocery store, people would, like, steal the cans of lobster all the time because it was so expensive. Well, that's that. Chaz ain't gonna change locations, is there? Hamburger sandwich. Uh, maybe I'll give that to you. Since you, you're so picky lately. You hate hamburgers too? What is wrong with you, Chumley? He hates everything. Oh, I see it. Oh, man. I can land the plain sandwiches today, but not the gold sandwiches. That's unfortunate. I already give him stuff today now. Where is he? You can't even get grilled cheese. That's not a thing in this. And boy from another planet. Uh, planet Royal Revolution. Mysterious Masquerade. You know what? Lawrence, I'm gonna take my rage out on you. Oh well. I've been able to get those gold sandwiches consistently, but uh, not today, apparently. I feel like I'm always just, like, one away. Dangerous pair, whatever that means. Goblin thief. Ooh, he's starting rude. Luckily, my ha whole hand is filled with brood cards. Only I could have gone first there. Okay, let's throw that down. Bait the magic jammer with this. Okay, nothing. Good. Set that down. Set this. Activate this. And if you activate Heavy Storm, I will end you, Lawrence. Five hundred. Upstart Goblin. Uh, okay. Am 
Come on now. Pay the Teddy Toll. You want to play the game? You pay your Teddy Toll. Goblin of Greed. Ooh, this won't help you. Hang on a second. It's only 1,200. It's probably the strongest monster he can freaking get anyway, so let's do it. No problem. No problem. Princess would be really good to draw right now. Oh, got it. This is fine. You know what I could do is I could just send these back to his hand so he has to pay to play them again with the chain energy. So let's do that. Activate the effect. And just for the hell of it, why not attack him? <laughs> the attack actually went through, too. That penguin's got the most basic-looking sword ever. He's playing Jar of Greed. Cost you some points there, buddy. He's putting Coach Goblin in. This is fine. I'm barely taking anything for him doing that. 2850. Oh, he's gonna take some bounce damage and get bounced if he attacks that. Come on, Lawrence. Can't do anything. Oh, you poor, poor soul. I didn't hold, did a whole lot of nothing. Good goblin housekeeping. He really wants to flip it all. Bake cookies with the new oven. I haven't had time to bake cookies. I'm gonna have to stream as soon as I get that new oven, but I will bake cookies at some point. Bake cookies in the shape of Teddy Urs's head. That would be extra wholesome. He's at 50 life points. 50 life points. Well, we're gonna have to put an end to him. Go to draw. Set everything on fire, and I win! Look at that. Ain't nothing that could go wrong there. 199. Hoarding all the points right now. Let's get up there. Let's take a look at the database, why don't we? Let's do this. Okay, full, full. Ugh, Chumley don't like me after that one sandwich I gave him. Lexus is full. Hey, Chaz is still growing quickly. He's like uh, just barely over two hearts left to get. I don't. I can even honestly do this easily without the dual. Uh, bleh. without the um gold sandwich, but still. Bastion is taking forever. I mean, I gave him the Destiny sandwich, so oh well, but still. I feel like Bastion's hearts never want to go up. They've been in the same place for an eternity. Time for bed. End the day. Go get a cat. I require cats. a dorm here. There you go. Free reason to get rid of a sandwich. There we go. Ashton only loves his waifu card. Oh, I hate you're right. I hate that you're right. That's just how he is. Sitting there thinking about it too. He had a great talk. Do I have anything for him? Tomatoes are fresh and delicious. Okay, good. He loved it. A little something to give him. 
And then I don't really have anything for Chumley still, do I? And to give Alexis. Let's just go to the store and see if I can get lucky and pull another one. That'd be good. How about now? 50 DP. I see another plain sandwich. Tofu sandwich. There we go. That's good for Bastion. I don't need plain sandwiches anymore. The cards they give aren't even great. Darn, ham's useless. Too many sandwiches. Oh, well, it's fine. Got anything that Chumley wants. Just have to talk to him like normal. You had a great talk. Yes, we did. Good talk, my dude. Talk to him. You've got the time to be here this early. You must have nothing else to do. So what do you want? Talk to him. Great talk. And try the jam. Okay, good. He does like jam. Now let's give Chaz a duel and probably just call it a night. Does he eat the sa can I even eat the sandwiches myself? Does that even does that really work? I didn't realize I could. Is there any effect to doing that? Alright, let's rough him up with some teddy tolls, and then I'm gonna get some dinner. That. Don't quite have Needleworm, but he might put something down, so let's just do that. Okay, he's just gonna go in with Mass Dragon. Oh! He's getting rid of the Teddy Toll. How dare you, Chaz? You can't just avoid pain for things because you're rich. Okay, he won't be able to beat over Yomi ship. If he does tribute it to summon level 5, then that means he's gonna just die when he kills it. 500. He lost Ojama Yellow. His ace is gone. MST, there's not even anything there. Oh, come on, man. I don't have anything. Ah, oh, just fine. Set this. Mirror Creighton's not really doing anything. He's getting burned. He's going for it. Am I gonna just have to mill him? Probably. Cylinder. Not that that's gonna do much. Alright, I guess I'm doing this. Let's go for it. 500 on you. He's going for Flying Kamakiri. He still can't beat over my Yomi ship. Yeah, you know what? I'll hit him with that. Speed up the burn a little bit here. Too bad I don't have Skull Invitation down to combo with Needleworm. Oops, I hit the wrong button there. Alright, he lost Call of the Haunted. He lost another Kamakiri. Oh, Cyberjar. <laughs> you know what? Why not? Why not? And we'll set this. Let's just flip the whole table here while we wait for this to finish. Creature- don't you dare, don't you dare. Okay, he gets to choose, so it's fine. 
Same result, so we're good. This is just gonna mill him even faster. Chain energy. Ooh, you love to see it. He's got 11 cards left in his deck now. Ooh, and he's gonna lose more if he attacks. I guess I'm going for mill. He discarded Oja Magic with that. And he... Wait, he discarded two Oja Magics. Cards he's got left. He has to be able to add all three for the effect to properly resolve, I think. Let me see here. Yeah, he has to. If he can't add all three, he doesn't get any of them. That's hilarious. Ojo Magic kind of bad. All Ojo Ojama cards are pretty bad, though. Let's be real. Okay, I can recycle Cyber Jar with that crap. This is fine. Let me just do this. Penguin. I may as well just go for the deck out now, why don't I? Let's do this. Oh, he got his Cyber Jar. He ain't playing around. He is not playing around at all. Okay, then let's do the let's do it like this, why don't we? First I'm gonna boop your back row. Level up. And I'm gonna throw this down. And I should have put Penguin first, but no, Cyber Jar is gonna destroy it. What am I saying? I don't need to do that. Hmm. You're gonna flip Cyber Jar anyway, so why not? Yeah, this is fine. Go ahead. Get burned. Yeah, I knew he would. He pretty much just, like, threw. Get level five. Oh, heavy storm. That will not help you, though, bro. I got swords, got curse, got curse. Yup, can't do a thing. Now he's just gonna pay all his remaining life points for just a nothing play. All I have to do now is end my turn and I win. I'm gonna discard some cards though. A lot of deck outs today, because of some cheesy shenanigans apparently. 386. Oh, impossible. You're supposed to be a loser. Supposed to be. But I don't play that role very well. There we go. Alright, for real now. I gotta end this, because I am starving. As much as I'd love to do my obligated uh, usual three hours, this is a good stopping point. Here we go. So we made good progress. Almost everybody has max hearts now. We started the episode with Cyrus maxed out, but now everybody except Chumley, Bastion, and Chaz. So, I hope you all enjoyed this. I think on the weekend I might do some more False Bound Kingdom before I do more of this again. I ended up just using the burn deck again for the entire episode, didn't I? Yeah, I literally did. Maybe next time I'll build something different, but I'm just kind of hoarding the points right now because I really needed to move on to the next part of the game. Anyways, this is where it's going to stop for YouTube. If you're watching there, have a good night. Bye-bye.